he doesn't see us while we're warming up before a game, so he's trying to, he depends on Guardy to kind of really be a, a relay that way. Uh, so I, th I think it's actually a great relationship. I've been a part of teams where the bullpen coach has never pitched a game in his life. So how's this guy going to help me out? You know, but he, this is a really, this is a good working relationship for these two guys. I'm pretty impressed with how they've done it. How exciting is it to have the full bullpen back together again and to be able to bring Sergio back? You guys had a really great rapport last year. Year, and obviously the success translated on the field to have that core back together. Is that something that plays in at all? I think so. I think, you know, experience is everything, I think, in this game, to be honest with you. I think uh, the way that they've done that, they, they brought the bullpen along, is we have a core group of guys that have been with each other for five, six, seven years now. And we know each other, we know each other's weaknesses, we know each other's strengths, we know, know what to look for with each other to help each other out, but we also can see when we look on the field and they're pitching, we can actually see he doesn't have it today. I can tell you why. Here's what he's doing. So some of those have to be ready. Or, you know, we think he, you know, and so we kind of anticipate a little bit along with Bochi and Rags on potential moves that might be coming based on what we're seeing out there because we know uh, each other so well. And then they bring in one, maybe two guys that are younger that can kind of almost come up with us and understand how we run a pen. And I think that's genius. I think that's to have a bunch of young guys with one or two veterans is really tough to do. Uh, so, but when you can have a group of veterans and one or two young guys that can eventually come in and basically take our jobs, which ultimately that's what you know they're trying to do. And I have no problem with it. I have no problem with somebody takes my job. I, I got 29 other teams I can look for a job from, but uh, in reality, if I can help a young kid and establish his career, that's what a lot of guys did for me, and so I want to give it back. And that's what this bullpen is built to do, is win, use experience to win, but also try to help the younger guys and teach them what it means to be a, a, a good bullpen and how we do it. Because we don't do it with 98. Uh, so we do it with a little bit of some experience and a little bit of some arm slot change. And, and, and so we use our mind a little bit we try to figure out creative ways to get guys out we're not going to blow everybody away having that core still together and, and being solid do you every year it seems like they put more and more on you in many cases this year there's not going to be a lot of power it's going to be more pitching they're going to really need it from you so to have that core and to know that you guys have each other's back going into a year like this when a lot is expected that's got to be comforting yeah it is and getting Kane back is huge man he's a horse yeah. man. He's, he's, he's like signing a huge free agent we're going to get him back so I think that yeah we understand that pitching and defense is what this team is built around but in the last five years it's worked three times so uh, you know we don't come in there with eight rounds a game we come in there with pitching we come in with defense and I think if you look at any major sport across the board if you, defense is going to help you win a lot of important games uh, you, the offense might help you throughout the season a little bit but when it comes to the championship when it comes to the playoffs your defense is going to be key because your offense might be a little tired and the pitching staff's gonna be a little tired, so we're gonna need guys making plays behind us. And I think this team, this team is built to to win in the playoffs. It's a, it's a defense and it's a pitching type team, and uh, with some good offense, we'll have good offense. We have good hitters, but uh, I'm not really gonna sit there and anticipate us getting eight runs a game. And I don't think anybody has a fear of getting two runs. I think we all are past that now. We just try to compete to win two to one. We have that thought going in. Jeremy, this might be 